Something, something Welsh. Something, something Welsh. Yes, the Welsh flag. An interesting one. So what it hereby goes without saying, the Welsh flag consists of a red dragon, passant on a green and white field. As with many heraldic charges, the exact representation of the dragon is not standardised. That's a big word. And many renderings exist. The flag, if you haven't noticed, the flag is not represented in the, you know, in the Union flag. The Union Jack, it's not, it's not present there. It's not. If you look up a picture of the Union Jack, and a picture of the Welsh flag, the, yeah, the Welsh flag isn't in it. And here we go again with the PowerPoint thing. <sighs> this sucks, I'm gonna sit here for five minutes this time. You will never know. Oh, okay, right. So, the design, it's got some weird language. Perfis Argent and Velt. A dragon passing ghouls. I'm thinking it's Welsh. But it means <laughs> green and white. White and green. The flag is white and green. With a dragon passant on the field. Yeah, I'm gonna take a rough guess. You can translate that if you want. Google Translate. Welsh, though, would be Welsh, not anything else. Use. Well, the use of the flag is it's the national flag of Wales, so yeah, <laughs> it's a national flag. Ah, now, the current version of the Welsh flag that we all know today was actually adopted in 1959, so it was created in 1959, that's pretty interesting. It's quite a while ago, not gonna lie. Proportion size, it's three by five. The proportion, it's proportion of three point five, three by five. That bit I've never really understood. This is a very short flag video. It's like we've got literally the Welsh flag design, use, adopted, proportion, and that's it. And then we move on to something else. It's half past ten at night. I'm gonna hit the hay. Whatever the Welsh say. She believe a dooby dee. She believe. Seriously.